Hey guys, today I'm going to be unboxing my Viking kit. I got this today at Joe Maxwell's Hobby Shop. Um, I'll give you a few specifications on this plane. Engine size is 35 to 40, length 33 and a half inches, wingspan 51, that's a good size. Wing area 572 square inches. Um, it comes with a lead out wire kit and adjustable lead outs, which is um, a lot. Or, um, so I, so I don't have to buy, like, separate leadouts. The other items required are the obvious glues and, um, weights or propeller or wheels, you know. Alright, now I'm going to unbox it. I don't, there we go. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to set the camera down for a second. First look at the kit. I've never really seen this plane, but it looks easy to build. So I got it. All right. Now we gotta cut that tape. Let's see if there's any. Other. Nope. All right, we're good. It's gonna be the first look at it. I am really excited. Might have to set the camera down again. Nope. There it is. There's the instruction book. The Viking. It says it comes with two full size plans, which I really like. Well, I wonder if this is the landing gear that comes out of the wing. I guess not. Yeah, that's that doesn't come out of the wing. Crap. There's the bell crank here's spars apparently. Uh, what's this one here? Part of the elevator. Ah, Leo kit. I love it. I'm really gonna enjoy this plane. This is my first built up, so I'm not going to know what most of these pieces are. That looks like the stabilizer. This is going to be really fun. And it is also going to be somewhat difficult. See, there's a hardware package. I think that's the um, motor mounts. I see the control horn down in here. I don't think I can get it out. Oh, maybe I can. Yes, I can. Okay, that's good. I don't think I need to bend this and they have a weird um, bell crank system or control horn system hopefully because I really don't like bending metal hmm that should be fun <clears throat> alright well that was the unboxing of my viking kit thank you for watching